actual demon, I see the actual angel. Primarily, demons translate as orbs, and angels usually translate through the camera as spheres or tubes. These are all spirits, and I'm trying to tell you, this is how massive of an influx of spirits are flying around. <laughs> They're everywhere. My house was full of spirits, and it's not normal. And that's why I came outside to see what was going on in the sky, and the entire sky is nothing but spirits. So what you're seeing right now is just minor compared to their massive. It's just absolutely insane. See those are those are angels. Oh my gosh, I have no idea what's happening. But there's something happening, and I hate to be one to call out CERN and that they opened up a portal, but there's no other common denominator other than it's quite possible something happened on the 8th of April. Well, and thank you, Jesus, that we all, if you know the Bible, if you read the Bible, you know what's happening. So there is nothing to fear. God is in total control of everything, and this is all prophesied. It's all coming to a quick, quick head. There's definitely something happening. This is incredible. And if I think back, I saw this type of activity. It was about this time last year. But again, I'm standing out here. I have not seen one in fact, okay? It just drives me crazy when people say they're bugs. If you watch the slowed down version of any of my videos, you can see there are, these are literal spirits. And I will slow this video down. I will, oh my gosh, you guys, this is incredible. I will slow this down and go frame by frame, at least um, on a few where I'm when there's the most, the largest influx of, so it's, it's, something's happening. Um, and again, this is in my. This is only my backyard. This is across the sky. So I'm going to switch over to a different camera and a different part of the house. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is incredible. Absolutely incredible. I don't know where they're going. They're just basically shooting across the sky, left and right, upside down, north, south, east, west. 
it's almost as though these spirits are, um, they're flying like insects, like pestilence. And maybe that's what the Bible means. I don't know if you saw that one glowing. Sometimes they glow. I have other videos where they are glowing. But maybe that's what the Bible means by pestilence, everyone. Maybe he's not talking just about insects. Maybe he is talking about spirits. Amen. It's incredible. Okay, I don't know if you all saw that orb, that big white orb, that was a demon. But see, most of what you're seeing right now are angels. And here's something I have to share with you is that every day I pray at least once that the Lord open up his heavens over my property. Um, and that the angels, so what you'll do is you'll pray that the Lord, first of all, you ask the Lord to, um, you enter your prayer with thanksgiving and praise, right? And then you ask him to forgive you for any sins. And then you ask him to cover you with the blood of Jesus. And then ask him if you would open up his heaven over you, over your home, over your family, with a sentry guard angel guarding the portal so that no demons can transfer through and that the demons can't close it, right? Then you ask him to loose warring angels. Who did you see that? Delivering angels according to Psalm 34-7. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him and delivers them. Amen. We also ask for ministering angels, healing angels if you need healing. And I do that. And so I see angels guarding over my house all the time. And I think that's probably why I'm seeing so many um, fears in this video right now. So they do. They will. Um, I will see demons trying to come into the property, and angels will actually swoop in front of them and push them back away from the property. It's it's real. And I mean, I love that I'm able to, to catch this on video, so that people um, really truly will believe that I'm not making this up. I have no reason to. And if you notice, my channel is not monetized. I'm not asking anyone for money. I'm just trying to share the glory of God and the fact that we do have angelic protection if we pray for it and if we are abiding in the Lord. If you're not abiding in the Lord and you're just out running amok and you're walking with the devil, then don't expect to see any kind of protection. And I'm sorry, just to see what I'm seeing right now, it's time to get right with Jesus if you're not right now because... Without him, you're not protected, and nothing can protect you from demons. Nothing except for Jesus Christ. Father God, the Holy Spirit, angels, all of that, but the name of Jesus is really, truly powerful. The demons do flee if you're abiding in the Lord. If you're not, the demons won't leave. They might leave, but they'll come back. And I have many videos on that. This is real, people, and it's going to get even more intense the, the more time it goes on. And it's just getting, happening more and more quickly. Like every day, it's 10 times more. The next day, it's 20 times more. The next time, it's, it's just amping up. Well, I pray if you don't know the Lord, then you ask the Lord Jesus to be your Lord and Savior. And all you need to do is believe in your heart. Just admit it with your verbally that you believe that Jesus is the Son of God, that he walked on this earth, 
that he died on the cross for your sins and that he rose again. Ask him to forgive you for your sins and to come into your heart and be your Lord and Savior. Ask him to be your Lord and your Savior, but you have to allow him to be your Lord. That means that you have to follow his commandments and abide in him, and he will protect you. It's the only way. Hallelujah. And I just I just found out, it's just so funny, I've been saying hallelujah forever, and I just found out what hallelujah means. Halla means to call upon or honor, praise, praise, right? And um, Yeshua, it basically means praise the Lord. So when you say hallelujah, you're saying praise the Lord. I think that's so beautiful. <laughs> All these years I didn't know that. So, hallelujah. Wow, you guys, this is crazy. Well, I pray this video is blessing you. In Jesus' name. And again, I will do a a a um, frame by frame version, so you will be able to see what I'm talking about. Again, these are not insects. I would be freaking out if bugs were flying around me like this. <laughs> oh, they're just angels and demons. But I've been seeing these things since 2010. It doesn't bother me because I know I'm protected. I follow the Lord with all my heart, all my heart, mind, soul, and body. I live for the Lord, so it doesn't bother me. But I'm telling you right now, the people that don't know Jesus, that don't believe in Jesus, that don't believe in this, they're going to have a very difficult time. And it's all in Revelations, you guys. It's all in the Bible. It's all in the Bible. This is all coming to fruition. I just pray everyone wakes up. Oh, I pray for open eyes and open ears and open hearts and repentant hearts the only way. God bless.